Now, I didn't drive to the outskirts of Greater Sudbury just to look at the outside of a train. I wanted to dig a little deeper. So I enlisted the help of local tour guide, Jordan. Okay, this is definitely a train. So what's this? What's the deal here? So this, this is... is actually the school car. So the first half is actually where the teacher and his family would live. And then the second half all the way down there is actually the school. So wait, was this like a rolling school? Like yeah, this was exactly. for like the kids. Oh, okay. And there's a zombie man or something. That's just to scare people who are walking through. Well, or... so, so the kids don't use the toilets mainly. But... Gotcha. Yeah. That is. Yeah, so it's essentially a scarecrow for children. Yeah. Oh <laughs> More God. or less. What are some of like the the hot ticket items here? I don't think you'll find some of the stuff we have here anywhere else in Canada. Mm -hmm. uh, just behind us, for instance, is a boxcar house. Back in the 20s and 30s, if you were a, a good worker for CN and they wanted to keep you, they would give you a boxcar. The other rolling stock we have, you, you can see it other places, but you can never see this much in one place, especially the two big engines we have, a 1944 locomotive, and we have recently redone a 1907 locomotive, which oh, wow. is just a piece of art. Right beside you, the caboose, mm -hmm. which kids can go right into and look and see a caboose. Hey, real quick, just on the end of that, how do you feel about that being co-opted as a word for the human butt? <laughs> I actually gave a tour um, with people from like, uh, not around Canada, like mm -hmm. they're in the, 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 the States. Yeah. They had no idea that a caboose actually was referring to a train. So like, oh, why, why, why are we going inside of a bus? That's unfortunate. Do you see the damage that you cause when, when people t like turn these fun, free words that just mean a part of a train and you turn it into something nasty? Look what it did for him. It almost got him a record as a sex criminal. We can't use that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go look at the caboose. Do you, can a penny actually derail a train or is that something my mom just told me to no, freak me out? No, no. The threat with a penny is that if you put it on the rail, the penny will actually launch and hit something else. Oh, so that is real. So yeah, but it's not, the train will be fine. Would you mind calling my mom and telling her that? Sure. Hey mom, remember the uh, thing about pennies and trains? Well, guess what? I happen to be with an expert right now. Hold on. Okay, you gotta talk to her. Hello? Yeah.